Ah, Darren. Welcome back. Jeffrey, I have chosen to meet you in a large room to allow for maneuvering in case you have another one of your episodes. Well, you have nothing to worry about, Darren. Although I do regret not killing you before, I am inclined not to kill you now, circumstances being what they are. I accept your apology. It's not an apology. And I am prepared to be generous. I will acknowledge that I bear some slight responsibility for what happened last season. Are you talking about your production? I'm talking about the sword play, perhaps. I provoked you unconsciously. Well, staying in the realm of conscious behavior, just for a minute, as artistic director, I must insist that you stage a reasonable Romeo and Juliet. Meaning what? Meaning no flames, no horses, and no flinging flaming horses at the audience. Save your breath, Jeffrey. I'm not the man I once was. Darren the anarchist is dead. Wer nicht fortgeht, kommt nicht heim. I beg your pardon. Have you ever been to Germany, Jeffrey? Mercifully, no. You should go. It would change your life. I could tell you stories of my six weeks in a Schwarzfeld puppet colony that would reduce you to tears. Suffice it to say, I have a new love, and it is the theater. Or, more specifically, the idea of theater. I am eager to work. All that I ask is that you will assure me that you will not interfere again with my rehearsals or my person. You have my word, Darren. Danke. Very good. Well, shall we? I'll go this way. 